Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. The birds are singing, the sausage is sizzling, and the lemongrass face is in the back bar in the hangar of the tower, and he's peddling his wares. Shall we have a look? Sharp intake of breath. We've got the multi mider tool. This is probably one of the best scout rifles in the game, in particular for player versus player in the multiplayer area. We've got soft ballistics, CQB ballistics, smart drift control, third eye, radar stays active while aiming down the weapon sights. Lightweight, if you want to move around, if you're feeling slightly fat, maybe you've had too many hot dogs, and uh, this agility boost is going to help you out. Quick draw, if you want to be uh, drawing your weapon unbelievably fast and then field scan for some extra ammo and then of course we've got the multi miter tool perk this weapon boosts movement speed and fires on a hair trigger doesn't the special ops look nice look at that and then of course if you want to be all camouflage in the uh, snow and you've got the arctic job as well that's really nice moving on we've got void fang, void fang vestments for warlocks this is a very good chess piece indeed if you haven't got one of these for your warlock and you've got plenty of strange coins to spare then i'd recommend picking this up because when you die and spawn in you have full grenade yet again so if you keep dying you're always going to have a grenade to maybe stop yourself from being spawn killed perhaps maybe increase discipline increase the discipline bonus and then of course the strength we've got more ammo for scout rifle more ammo for sniper rifles solar burn defense reduces incoming solar burn damage and increased armor when using a void based subclass definitely recommend that if you haven't picked one up already for hunters we've got sealed Amkara's <coughs> grasps this is uh, a very interesting pair of gauntlets here the exotic perk nightmare fuel gain an additional melee charge melee damage has a chance to automatically reload your primary weapon don't you know a boost for increased intellect increased strength we've got switchblade decreases melee attack cooldown and momentum transfer gain bonus melee energy on grenade hits then we've got sniper rifle reloader and of course speed boosts for rocket launcher reloading as well moving on we have the armamentarium the classic from year one for the titans this is a very tremendously helpful uh, armor chess piece here uh, you get an additional grenade charge so you can just lob lightning grenades until the cows come home increased intellect increased discipline special ammo for a uh, carry more special ammo basically carry more heavy ammo very very useful arc recovery arc armor increased arc armor when using an arc based subclass so uh, for the moment this setup is definitely a good one for uh, striker titans and then we've got legacy engram if uh, for the exorbitant price of 29 strange coins if you happen to be chasing a pair of boots from year one then maybe you'd if if you were feeling a bit insane you'd pick one of these up weapon ornaments this week are uh, the heart of gold this is for truth this is a very interesting one it changes your truth rocket launcher to look very gold and call of duty so if you fancy that, pick that up. Then we've got Iconoclast. This is to change the uh, appearance. This is a weapon skin for the Invective Exotic Shotgun. So uh, if you fancy those, you can pick them up for 25 pieces of silver dust. Curios, we've got a green exhaust trail to upgrade on your rare sparrow. And a pink one as well if you're feeling a bit fancy, you're feeling a bit floral. And then you can pick that up and upgrade your blue sparrows that you may have. Heavy ammo synth, stock up on this, rank up your faction packages and hopefully get past 365 light. Uh, very, very worthwhile. If you're playing the raid, heavy ammo having and having a surplus of it is extremely, extremely helpful. Three of coins that stock up on as much of these as possible go out there farm exotics it's an excellent way to raise your light level at the moment and of course bag yourself some new and interesting gear if you've just joined us in the whole destiny party and then glass needles these are very interesting very helpful if you pick up say um, a void fang vestments and you're not happy with the armor but the armor uh, boosts or the armor defense here or maybe you want to change these stats from intellect discipline or intellect strength discipline strength then you have a chance at re-rolling those perks with the glass needles they are a little on the expensive side and you do need an exotic shard so use those at your own risk 
And that, ladies and gentlemen, brings us to the end of this Thursday video. I do hope you've enjoyed yourselves. Thank you very much for watching. I've been Story Machine. I do hope you've enjoyed this video. If you did, then you can slap the indicator of the upward thumb and look forward to seeing us very, very soon. In the meantime, though, Guardians, smoke us a kipper. We'll be back for breakfast.